Hello, my name is Andrei Yakolev. I am from Technical University of Moldova. And I want to present uh, our work, Inventory of Water and Natural Gas Distribution Infrastructure in the Rural Locality and Creation of Basic JS Database. <clears throat> General overview. Urban water systems are the most valuable part of the public infrastructure worldwide, and the utility companies and municipalities are entrusted with the responsibility of managing and expanding them for current and future generations. Infrastructures inexorably age and degrade, while society places increasing demands for levels of service, risk management, and sustainability. Water distribution companies in the Republic of Moldova are municipal, not private companies. The biggest water distribution company is Upper Canal Chisinau, serving municipality of Chisinau, capital of Moldova. It manages 1,560 kilometers of water pipelines and other infrastructure. This is the only water company in Moldova which has GIS database of water and sewerage infrastructure and approved procedures for adding new connection geodata based on topographic survey 1 to 500. Its GIS database is powered by ISRAI products. This is a very good example how water and sewerage GIS database should work. So here is a map of uh, Kishinev Water and Sewerage Company. It is a browser map window. And here you can see water layers, sewerage layers, and some special layers which can be used for uh, decision making. This is an example of survey plan 1 to 500. It's an AutoCAD drawing of new water and sewerage connection. Uh, you can see here a black line with liter C. It's a sewerage. And you can see a um, black line with liter A. It's a um, water pipe. This drawing later is used for populating Upper Canal Kishinev GIS database. Proposed inventory procedure is a low cost solution for water and sewerage distribution infrastructure, basic GIS database creation. It is uh, it was done in frame of land inventory in the commune Palanka, 718 households, Stefan Water District, Republic of Moldova. In rural areas, utilities documentation is represented only in paper form, mostly being schemas, not georeferenced maps with no scale. Usually these schemas are not updated on adding new infrastructure connections. Base map for the inventory served Orthophoto from year 2016, created by the support of Norwegian government. Based on the Orthophoto, a digital line map is created by state cartographic company in Geocard. It consists from buildings, by roof contour, fences, roads, hydrography, forestry, contour lines, and other layers. This line map is equivalent to a classic one to 2000 map. This is an example of line map with orthophoto. Here you can see some roof contours, fences, contour lines, 
rods, power lines, and other. The only paper documentation for the water infrastructure in the Camion Palanca was designed plan for water system rehabilitation in 2008. The base map for the design plan was topographic plan 1 to 500, which even was found in Camion Archive as DWG file, AutoCAD. Unfortunately, after overlaying it with Orca Photo 2016 map, we realized that better to use orthophoto and line map for primary water infrastructure digitization due to several issues, better area of interest coverage, better topographic item securacy, fences, buildings, no transformation issues to new state coordinate system mode def 99. The design plan was scanned, merged from multiple images in one and J referenced. It was done to have it in a digital form for our archive. We used AutoCAD raster design software to perform this task. The second step was to digitize water design plane. Quantum GIS software was used for all desktop GIS tasks. Prior to digitizing, geodata structure was established taking in account which water infrastructure geodata can be collected. Geodata were divided into groups, point and polyline, data format with shape. Point data includes manholes, hydrants, water towers, underground water sources, artesian wells, for example. Polyline data are pipelines. Point attribute data are very simple. Item type, manholes, water towers, etc. Number, in case the item has its personal number, for example, hydrants has their own numbers. Uh, state is functioning, no functioning. Accuracy, uh, approximative and precise. Precise is, uh, means that data are digitized from topographic survey data. Polyline attribute data are diameter, material, state, accuracy. This is an example of QG's work map window. You can see line map layers water lines, water points, and their attribute data tables. So after digitizing pipelines and infrastructure, we had to print a one to 1000 map for field inspection. Printed map included topographic data like fences, buildings, roads, poles, etc., along water data. In frame of field inspection, consumer manholes where water meters are installed, have been located and represented on the paper map. Thus, 550 consumer manholes were inventory. The final water utility map was printed at scale 1 to 1000 and will be used in the future for different inspection and management tasks. Created shape files were then uploaded to a local public authority geo portal primaria.gsquid.com, which is implemented based on a WebJS solution gsquid.com, developed by a Moldavian company vec.md. In this way, water geodata will be accessible via WMS, WFS services for future design and maintenance tasks. This is a browser window of a WebJS solution. You can see on the left layers. On the right, this is map window. Um, access is granted via username password. So different users can take advantage of this data. Water data 
open via WFS in AutoCAD Map 3D. For this example, uh, water points and water lines were opened and added to the drawing. With attribute data, you can see on the right in the properties window. Results. Results of the utilities infrastructure inventory are technical documentation is digitized, basic GIS database, shape files created, resulted water geodata published on the specialized geoportal with WFS WMS service, and the actual water paper map printed for inspection and maintenance. Um, here you can see two tables with some totals, total length of the water pipelines are 25 kilometers, um, 562 manholes, 90 hydrants, three water wells and three water towers. And this is a map overview of the inventory of what infra infrastructure inventory. Described inventory procedure is a low cost solution for water and natural gas distribution infrastructure, basic JS creation. It can be used as a first step for accurate infrastructure geodatabase establishing. Thank you very much.